Welcome, in front of me is a Xiaomi 13T Pro and today I will show you how you can import contacts from your SIM card to the device. So to get started, find your standalone contacts application, like this one. From here you want to navigate to Fix and Manage and then select Manage SIM. This in turn will show you all the contacts that are located on your SIM card. By default, they will all be selected, so if you don't want some of them, you can deselect them. Uh, additionally, if you are also logged in into a Google account, you can swap it between a Google account or device, which will be the two options. Unless you have more than one Google account signed in, then obviously you can choose either one of these accounts that you have. Um, I don't have any kind of Google account signed in, so it automatically defaults to the device itself. But if I had, I would have a drop down right here under the manage SIM, which would allow me to switch between the account and device. Anyway, from here we can select import. It asks us if we want to delete the copies of contacts that are on our SIM card. Don't do it, it's absolutely stupid. This option should not be on the device, so I'm gonna select keep. The reason I recommend keeping it is because when we go to contacts, as you will see right now, these contacts don't really interfere with your device. So I have imported them to the device once I select it. It only shows me contacts that are located on my device. Or I can swap it to, for instance, the SIM card and this will show me only the SIM card contacts. So it's really counterproductive to get rid of them because if anything would happen to your device and you just want to take out the sim card put it into another device you would no longer have the contacts on there therefore i don't recommend doing so anyway as you can see there are the contacts now depending on where you imported your contacts you might need to swap it so press right here and switch between the options that are visible to you sim card device and google accounts i don't have google accounts so it only gives me these two options so there we go. Now, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.